Hello, hello, hello. Tanya Tarot. Hey, babies, come on in and have a seat. If you're new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you are returning, welcome back. Mwah. Hi, babies, I missed you. So come on in, my beautiful people. And yes, me, you are beautiful too. We're going to jump straight on into this. If you're new here, babies, I usually pick up on Divine Masters, Divine Film, Karmic Energy over here on this channel. Um, I usually do, uh, I'll do Zodiac signs at the beginning of the month. So next week I'll be doing Zodiac signs. And then um, for the rest of the month, it's usually Divine Masters, Divine Film, Karmic Energy over here. Okay, babies? So if that's what you're interested in, stick around. We're going to see what spirit has for you guys. Oh, what's going on when it comes to your love life? What do you need to know? Okay, so I'm feeling like I'm doing this from Divine Femme energy, okay? So Divine Femme, what's coming in for you when it comes to your love life? This is for Divine Femme. And me and you can be feminine energies as well, okay? So if it resonates with you, take what resonates with you. What does it, honey? It's all energy. Okay, we're ready now. Thank you. In the name of the Mother, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. It's for my divine femme spirit. What is coming in in love? For my divine femme. What does my divine femme need to know right now when it comes to your love life? Thank you. Honey, you got a surprise coming, babies. You may be about to be surprised, okay? Something's coming and you don't even see it. It's going to catch you off guard. Some type of shock, okay? Some type of news. Some type of arrival. But something's going to... Somebody could be bringing you a gift here. Tell me what else is going to put my divine film, okay? Um, somebody may feel like you may not be receptive because receptive came out in reverse, okay? They may feel like you're not going to be receptive when they bring you this gift. It says be ready to receive what fate has planned for you, okay? Um, so whoever this is is coming towards you with this surprise... They may feel like you're okay, so turning back around. They may feel like you're not receptive or you may not want to accept this when they come towards you. Okay, I normally don't take reverses. Reverses. What is going on? Reversals in this deck, but spirit said I am today. So, okay. It is what it is. Tell me more when it comes to my divine feeling, what's going on in their love life. Yeah. There could have been some type of temptation in the past, and this is why this person may feel like you're not receptive. To this gift, to this offer, to to whatever the surprise is that they're coming towards you with, okay. Think think carefully about the situation, okay. So spirit is saying, divine feeling, when this person comes towards you, think carefully about the situation. This person may feel like you're not going to be receptive because you're thinking about this, this carefully about the situation as well. There could, like I said, there could have been some type of temptation here. One more for divine film. yeah. It says labyrinth. Even when you feel lost, there is always a way through the labyrinth. So divine film, I feel like when this person comes towards you, um, with this surprise, it's going to catch you off guard, okay? You may or may not be receptive when it comes because of whatever happened with this person in the past, whatever the temptation was, okay? My spirit says when you're feeling lost because you may not know what to do, there is always a way through this maze, okay? There's always a way through the confusion, when this person pops up, like I said, it may cause you some type of confusion because you're going to be surprised. Bottom of the deck, synchronicity. A divine soul counterpart relationship is blessed with amazing moments of synchronicity. So this could be a divine soul mate. So divine master is coming back with some type of surprise here. He's afraid that you're not going to be able to, or not be able to, or that you won't be receptive because of the shit he's done in the past, because of whatever temptations there may have been. Okay, so he knows that you're guarded. Okay. Um, and there may be a lot of confusion right now. This this divine masculine does want to come towards you and be open though. Be open to accept divine guidance in your relationship. So I do feel like your your divine masculine here is open, and they're hoping that you're open when, when they come towards you. Not this one. Okay, tell me what's going on when it comes to my divine fam. 
and and her connection with the divine masculine and her love life what's going on with the divine femme and her love life what does divine femme need to know about your love life or his love life what does divine femme need to know about your love life thank you name of the mother the father the son and the holy spirit Clarify surprise. Okay, yeah. Somebody didn't tell the truth. So somebody found out that somebody was lying. And this might be why they're not receptive. Clarify receptive in reverse. Yeah, so this King of Cups, King Queen, King Queen, Lord Jesus. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy here. Could have been lying. Okay, they weren't being honest. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini energy. This person could be angry. Angry, 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 angry. Because somebody was lying. Okay, Spirit, I got it. Divine Masculine feels like you're angry, Divine Femme, because of some type of lies. And this is why they feel like you're not receptive or you won't be receptive when they come in with this gift or this offer, whatever that may be. Clarify the temptation here, Spirit, for my divine fam. Yeah, they've been going through some type of karma, judgment. 11-11, twin flame, um, twin ray, divine masculine, high level, commitment here, life partner here. And whoever this is, they've been in her mode. They've been to themselves right now, um, dealing with whatever this karma was, and they're angry. They're angry. I feel like <laughs> I feel like they're angry with themselves, but they also feel like you're angry with them. You're passing judgment on them. You won't be receptive because of their lies. This person could be praying to God right now. I do feel like they feel like time is running out here. They're on the on the clock. They're on a the clock. And they could be all up in their head right now. Keep feeling like they're hitting a brick wall. Clear by clear flight. Oh, I cannot talk. Oh my god. Is there a fucking um it gotta be either Mercury Mercury, Mercury I cannot talk. Mercury what okay. If there is somebody, Spirit, that is trying to stop me from getting the message out, trying to stop me from speaking, sending negative energy towards me, I send that shit back. I bind it up and I send it back now. Ten times fold. Okay. If not, then there's a Mercury retrograde coming up. Okay? Because my speech only fucks up when Mercury retrograde is coming or somebody playing with it. They're trying to keep me from getting this message out. Okay? Clarify labyrinth. Queen of Coins in reverse. Somebody is. Oh, mm, mm, mm. They could they could be um, losing money at this time. That could be part of their karma. There could also be a third party. This Queen of Coins here. That's in reverse. That was broke. Angry as well. Backing funds. This is crazy here, y'all. Yeah, now your person wants to come towards you here, Divine Masculine. And they want to um persevere. Let's go a little bit deeper because we already know the karmic is here. So the karmic. Mm, the karmic brought your person, Divine Masculine, a lot of karma here, okay? They face some type of karma. But it was behind some type of lies. Lies and deception. Now your person wants to come towards you with some type of surprise, some type of gift. But they know you're not receptive because of the lies and deception they, they put towards you here. And it's because they followed their temptation. They went towards this third party. And then <laughs> their judgment was off. They chose the wrong person. Clarify surprise and the ace of swords in reverse. 
Thank you. Now this person is seeing you in their dreams. They're dreaming about you. They're, they're, they're daydreaming about a connection here with you. How to come toward you. What to say. Clarify receptive in reverse. And the king of cups in reverse. Clarify receptive and king of cups in reverse. And now they want to come in and they want to transform the situation with you. And they're dreaming about how they can come in and transform the situation with you. Clarify temptation and judgment from my collective. Yeah, this person is now listening to their intuition. And they can't stop having reoccurring thoughts about you. They can't get you off their mind. They want to change. They want to come in and ask you for a date. Clarify the labyrinth and the queen of coins in reverse. Yeah, now they want to reach out and talk to you. They're going to come tell you about the bullshit that this queen of coins, this karmic energy put them in this maze. This confusion. Clarify the nine of wands when it's for my divine feminine. Yeah, now your person is reflecting. They're reflecting and they want to come back towards you once again. Date night. They want to ask you out here. Divine Master wants to come in and ask you out. Yeah, now he wants to focus on you. Yeah, and he wants to come out of separation with you. Can you my recurring thoughts, temptation? Is that it? Okay, he wants to focus in and come out of separation? Yeah. He wants to come and talk about this temptation of 32 flavors. He's being led. He knows the separation had to do with the fact that he had 32 flavors. Okay? And he keeps thinking about that. He's thinking about the fact that he didn't listen to his intuition. This is what he wants to come in and talk about. Yeah, he also is missing your tender touch. Memory. Told you missing your tender touch here. One more for reflection and a nine of wands. One more for reflection and a nine of wands. Yep, there you go, divine master. He is reflecting. He wants he wants connection. He wants to come in. He wants to talk. He wants to be near you. He wants something long term. Let's get um the divine masculine troops. Let's see. Hold on. I have one. Hold on, guys. I gotta find the deck. Uh oh. It's not, is it this one? Yep. Do, 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 do. So let's see. Divine feminine, what divine masculine's truths are at this time. When it comes to you guys' love life. Because uh, I don't usually read them in reversals, this particular deck. But I do have a thing with the OCD about everything being all in the right order. So y'all have to hold on and bear with me just a second. So just in case it does come out in reverse, I can read it. That way if Spirit says so. Hey guys, and we know it was not by accident or just because it was already in reverse. Oh, so I think that's it. Okay, babies. So final messages for my divine feminists when it comes from their divine masculine. Oh, this is um the facts deck, urban divine masculine truth deck. So what is the truth for my divine feminine when it comes from their divine masculine? What is the truth? Final shuffle. Thank you. Name of the mother, the father, the son, and the Holy Spirit. And I do need it to jump. So for my divine films and their love life with divine masculine. And divine masculine said he got a reality check, babies. Okay? Is this just fantasy? See, they were dealing with somebody that was just a fantasy. That was a fake, the karmic. Okay? Now they're focused on you. 
Because they ain't got this reality check. They want to come out of separation. What else does the divine masculine want to say to the divine feminine at this time? What is his truth? He says, I want to have a baby with you. I want you, excuse me, I want you to have my baby, is what it says. Okay? So now they want you to have their baby. They want to come out of separation. They've gotten a reality check about where their focus should be and who it needs to be on. Clarify where divine masculine is feeling about my divine feminine when it comes to divine feminine's love life. It told you, it says, I found out the hard way that all kitty ain't good for me. 32 flavors, okay? They realized that this third party wasn't a good kitty. And they say, every time my phone rings, I hope that it's you. They praying that it's you. They're hoping that it's you. They're wishing that it's you. Divine Masculine is doing the shadow work at this time. They say, I'm doing the work. Uh -oh. Divine Master says he feels your pain, babe. I feel your pain, babe. He says, I'm ready to stop hiding from you. Ready to come out of separation. You're the freak, 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 and they miss you. They say you brighten up their world. They love you. And finally, they, they're going through an awakening. They're going through an awakening here, babies. Okay, and when they come back, they will be ready. They say, I never knew a love like this. I am drowning in my emotions. Your person is drowning in their emotions. Divine masculine is drowning in their emotions when it comes to you. Any other true spirit? Anything else? Want to thank you? And it's the final one. Well, I told you they're doing the shadow work. They're going through an awakening. Bottom of the deck. Divine masculine. Can't make it up. Okay, baby, so Divine Masculine is doing the shadow work. He is awakening. He wants you to know that he loves you. Okay? He is he is done hiding and ready to come forth and have this conversation. He is done being in separation. He is doing the work and he is transforming. He is angry at himself for lying at you or lying at you, lying to you. Okay? He keeps seeing you in his dreams. He is now ready to focus on you and this connection because he got a reality check about this third party here. Okay? And he feels your pain. He feels your pain because the same pain he caused you has now been caused to him or her. Okay, guys? Remember, I just read from my, my perspective because it's easier. Okay? This, this divine masculine was out here being led by temptation, by the 32 flavors. Okay? Out here just living buck wild. Right? Now, this, their intuition, their answers, or their spirit guides keep putting you in their head. When they were with you, connections, thinking about you. Okay? This person is now, can't get you off their mind. Constantly reoccurring thoughts about you, right? And they're realizing that the, that the, the 32 flavors they was fucking with, they found out the hard way that all kitty wasn't good for them, okay? They could have possibly got burned by this little kitty. And now they love you and they want to do the shadow work here. And they, they, they want to reach out and talk to you, but they're afraid that you're not going to be receptive, Right? So every time the phone rings, because they're missing your touch, they want to talk to you back. They're missing you. And every time the phone rings, they're hoping that it's you here, babies, okay? Because they now are awakened to you in this connection, and they want to tell you, but they're afraid you're not going to be receptive because they were, they, were, they were unloving and a liar in the past. Okay? They didn't give you what you deserved in the past. They chased temptation. And they got caught up in a fucking maze, a web of lies and deceit. The same way they lied, caught you up in their web of lies and deceit, they got caught up in a web of lies and deceit. And they got a real, a real, real, real reality check around this motherfucker. And now they feel your pain. They feel how you feel. You guys are mirroring each other. And now they have changed their focus and they can't stop dreaming about you. They can't. They see you in their dreams. They're ready to transform. Okay, babies? So if this resonated with you, all, let me know down in the comments section. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. If you're interested in booking a personal, all my information is down below um, to book and buy. And I think that's all the business, babies. Um, everything is restocked except for the spiritual bath, babies. Um, I know they were supposed to be up. I just been booked and busy which i'm grateful for so i haven't had a chance i will um try to make all the the um 
bath sauce tomorrow and get the spiritual um sauce and some more candles up there as well okay my loves and i think that's it personals uh started uh 15 minutes for 30 dollars questions started five dollars and 55 cents and uh everything else goes up from there mediumship is 30 minutes 55 dollars okay babies um i think that's all so as always my loves you keep rocking with me i'm gonna keep rocking with you love light and peace Mwah! bye my tt babies